What's up, guys? John here, Titan Lifestyle with Big Drew. What's up, guys? It's Titan Lifestyle. It's Big Drew here with John. I'm glad to be back. We've been gone for two weeks. We've had all kinds of stuff going on. Woo. We're going to fill you guys in today. Woo. Yeah, man. Christmas, New Year's, all those good little holidays. Uh, they passed, and they just happened so so far fall on Fridays, New Year's yeah. Day and Christmas. So we hope you guys had a good New Year's, good Christmas, and we got a lot to share yeah. with you. The 2021 is going to be a huge yeah. year for us. Yeah. For sure. Can't it's wait. Be Excited. First thing I want to do is say thanks to John, my boy, <laughs> my Titan brother. I went to his house on Christmas. My man. His family took me in. We had dinner. We had food. Watched the new Spider Woman movie, which is eh. Wonder Woman, right? But Wonder Woman. Wonder, that's what it was. Wonder <laughs> Woman. Yeah, see. <laughs> if it was that good, I remembered it. Man. But I want to thank him. Had a great time. It was a great Christmas well, to spend it with my boy John. Absolutely, man. So it was, it was just awesome. And we don't, you know. Drew's your family, man. This dude's like family to me. He's with me all the time. These, these past year and a half, this time we spent together, man, come real close. Done a lot of things. We got a lot more to do. So Christmas is just one good thing. New Year's we got to spend together. Yeah, it was great. I'm Carnage, so Woo! Was great. Stay inside of Carnage. It's my first time seeing Carnage perform. Yeah. I'm not really a Carnage fan until yeah. now. It was ridiculous. Yeah. The intro was ridiculous. But also, the ladies hooked it up with the fila. Yep. The Greek food, guys. It's like a grape leaf wrapped in, like, uh, ground Ooh. beef. Ooh. You know I eat ground beef every day. So as soon as they said they were making that, I don't know if you guys saw the video. But shout out to Sharice and yep. Amanda yes. for making some really, really good fila. Yes. That stuff was good and it was clean. It yeah. takes a long, long time it to does. make. And you eat it so fast. So I yep. almost felt guilty when they're just sitting there making it. <laughs> For like two hours, like it's ready. I was just like, boom, it's done now. So it's like, but thank you guys. Thank That's you. it. And yeah. thank you, John. Big yeah. shout out to the girls, man. You know, uh, Sharice, and she's not even Greek, you know, but she learned this family recipe, uh, you know, and it's awesome. It's an all one meal. It's got rice, it's got ground beef, it's got a little bit of onion, a little, little tomato. It's so ground up, you don't so need to taste because we don't want so that. Good. And the grape leaves, so you're getting your greens in automatically. Mm -hmm. So it's just, a, it's an all in one meal. Uh, it just takes forever, you know, the preparation of it, them rolling it, you know. Yeah. And at that point, you know, it, it makes it taste that much better. Because yeah. you know it's homemade. And I was literally sitting there like, like I was like a dog, like sitting right in the kitchen just staring at them the whole yeah. time watching them make it. So, yeah, it was good. And I hate vegetables. But yeah, the grape too. leaves, it's basically ground beef yep. seasoned, wrapped in grape leaves. But the yep. moisture and everything, you could just pick it up and bite it. It's like a, a grape leaf ground beef burrito. It's yeah, close to Real good. So good, so good. And I'm a big, big thing about that. Yeah. We will talk about some peptides for you guys. So we'll, we'll get in some questions for you guys right away. I want to thank all you guys for joining us on Instagram and Facebook. We got a lot of good information to share with you guys, especially the therapies of the week, which is the new year, new year, new year, new you, Titan Lifestyle Therapy, which is the package of Titan Up and our ECA Stack Plus. But let's get into our first question. All right, so peptides. What can you talk about peptides for healing after surgery? And Joe Rogan's peptide regimen. So let's talk about healing peptides. And depending on what the issue is and where the injury is, uh, but it's after surgery, it's even better. So the thing about surgery is you want to heal faster. Now, the older that we get, it's we, we don't heal as fast, right? We don't heal as, as good as we normally would when we're younger. I don't know Joe Rogan's regimen because... Listen, I like Joe Rogan, but I ain't got time to listen to Joe Rogan's podcast. Right. The most I hear about Joe Rogan is through Art, because I know Art listens to Joe Rogan's podcast, so he'd probably be able to tell me the regimen, but I have no idea. But what I can tell you is, is the best peptides to use for healing that I've used, I know we've all used here, um, is BPC-157 and TB-500. So from wounds healing faster uh, to the repair in the body, whether it's uh, soft tissue damage, uh, ligaments, um, torn muscle, joint areas. So this is gonna really, really help. So at that point, you're really gonna wanna use both of them in combination to get the best result. They do work solo really good too as well. Yeah, mm -hmm. TB500 worked great for my elbows. Um, like I'm just realizing now that I did have elbow problems like a couple months oh, ago. for sure. But uh, yeah, if you and also if you use them both together, guys, it works a lot better. I mean, obviously one, yep. if you can only afford one, that's fine, but yep. using both, I'm a firm believer in going all out if you're trying to get healthier, if you're trying to heal something. Yeah. You know, within reason, whatever your doctor says you could do. For sure. But I would definitely go with both. Um, and a lot of times people always talk about small joints like your elbows or your knees, but even your back. Yes. It can help with your back pain, yes. lower back pain and stuff like that, or even neck pain too. Inflammation. Inflammation in yeah. the neck. If you have any, any old neck injuries, football, hockey, whatever, or car injuries yeah. or something like that, accidents, you have any neck problems, can help with your neck too. But also, I've heard a lot of people take peptides and just go through the pain, mm -hmm. thinking that the peptide is going to correct it. No. Make sure you're okay 
by the doctor medically right. to work out first. Don't just right. say, oh, my elbow hurts. I'm going to go to Titan, get my BPC and my TB500, and then now I can go work out through the pain. Make yeah. sure you're seeing that right. that injuries first. Absolutely. Otherwise, you're going to have all kinds of other issues. Absolutely. So he's got the exact same thing on my head right here. That blue suit is badass. So this is definitely yeah. a one of two. So Drew's got one. Yeah. I got one of these blue uh, tight Nike suits. I haven't got the bust bite out, but I had he to, looks I had, I had beautiful to out today. today. I love it. Love it. It's got the zipper pockets. Nike, I love it. Superhero love it. style. Yeah, I love it. Man, watch out. Drew's coming for you guys. All right, so Bigazzo, what's going on? Uh, my bad. Can you repeat the names again? Yeah, BPC one five seven, TB five hundred. So those are two best healing peptides out there as far as what you're looking. Now, to do. people are if people are asking about those, wanting those. Do they need blood work with those? So you don't need blood work for any of the peptides. That's a great question. Thank you for bringing it up, Drew. So none of the peptides, as far as that goes, you don't need any blood work. All you have to do is fill out the new patient paperwork, and at that point, you'll see our medical provider, and then you can order these awesome healing peptide therapies for you guys. Yeah, so, if you're, and if you're like me, you don't like dealing with people in person. Yep. I love being around my Titan family, but yeah. everybody else is kind of, yeah. if you don't like dealing with people in person, do everything from your phone. Yep. You can fill, fill out the new patient paperwork from your phone. Yep. It's almost like your own data entry guy. You can Absolutely. just fill everything out, get everything set up, and do everything over the phone. You yep. don't have to come in for the initial nope. paperwork or anything like that. Do everything nope. from the phone and get you all set up. And next thing you know, you got the stuff in the mail and you're ready to go. Yep. Electronic, you can yeah. fill out the patient paperwork. You can see the medical provider from your comfort of your own home or office through your cell phone, desktop, uh, tablet, whatever it may be. And at that point, after that's done, you can order the peptides or therapies and they come directly from the U.S. pharmacy to your doorstep or office or wherever you're at. All right, so is TB500 offered in oral or is it only injectable? So we do offer it both in oral and injectable form. Um, you know, probably the best form, obviously, is going to be injectable. The best transportation rate, a higher absorbency, not getting broken down. The only one I would say that might be better orally would be BPC-157. The reason is, is because BPC-157 comes from the gastric juices in, in, in your stomach. So at that point, it's going to be able to help stomach issues like IBS, um, you know, people have all kinds of different issues when, when it comes to the stomach. Um, even with, when they're trying to process food, mm. this can actually help that too and help the breakdown of that. So actually work properly. Especially new foods too. A lot yes. of times people people change their diet. They go from eating bad food and that's not healthy, but the body got used to it. So it's processing and digesting it the same yep. way. Next thing you know, they're eating chicken and rice and vegetables yep. and the body's kind of jammed up at first. Yep. It's not that the food isn't good. Your body just has to get used to it. So again, with that gastric stuff, probiotics, all that stuff's going to help you guys get regulated. For sure. That's that's definitely a good one. Uh, do you guys call Semerlin and Emperlin something different at Titan? And what is the cost? So, no. So... All right, so semorelin is, is, is a good GHRH. It's just the first one, actually. So it's a growth and releasing hormone peptide. Um, and it works by stimulating the pituitary gland. Now, they usually would put semorelin with before with GHRP2 or GHRP6 or both of them. Um, those are stimulating peptides, growth hormone stimulating peptides as well. And they work by increasing the pulse to the pituitary to stimulate your own growth hormone. Now, what we've done is is we use the, the new and improved version, let's say, of semorelin. That's CJC1295. So it's a better version. It's the predecessor of semorelin. Um, the way it works better is, is that it stays in the body a lot longer, so the half-life's longer. So it's going to get you a better result as far as that goes. Now, Improlin, the exact same thing. It's the predecessor of GHRP2 gHRP2 and GHRP6. Now you're going to take this, and when you used to take these other ones, it could possibly raise like um, like sugar levels in the body and have other issues, like cortisol levels raising and stuff like that. With this, you're not going to get any of those negative side effects per se. So you don't have to, you know, worry about it, um, and it's going to give you a better result because if it's in the body longer and mm. it's hitting that pulse a lot more to the pituitary, it's going to work a lot better for you. So it's just CJC1295 and Imperellin, that's what you would order if you were ordering one of the therapies from us at Titan Medical Center. We still do have Semerolin though. So if you guys really want Semerolin, we do. But I'm telling you, the better version, same price. So I mean, at that point, you know, wouldn't you want the better version for the exact same amount of money, the better bang for the buck? CJC 1295. But there are people out there that say, hey, listen, you know, I, I want Semerolin. So you guys are more than happy to get that therapy as well. Can you do both of these to heal from skin removal surgery? Yes. So BPC-157, TB-500, and you could do CJC-1295 uh, with Imperolin too because that will helpfully raise IGF-1 levels uh, and actually stimulate the pituitary, which is going to help healing too as well. So you're actually hitting three different factors um, that don't overlap each other, that are all hitting three different directions to help you heal a lot quicker. All right, all right. You wait. What up, Kimberly? How you doing, Trey? Doc Strangey? You're welcome. 
So let's move on to our next things. Let's move on to the therapy of the week. New year, new you, new Titan. So let, let's talk about the Titan therapy package for the new year. This is just one of them, and that is Titan Up and our ECA Stack Plus. Yeah. So we want to introduce one injectable for you guys and uh, an oral, um, so weight loss medication as far as that goes, so you guys can hit it from two different angles. Now, Titan Up is one of our first vitamin amino acid injectable therapies. It has MYC, it has B-complex, B12, one branch chain amino acid, and L-carnitine in it. Yeah, a lot of times people hear the Titan Up and they just hear multivitamin. They forget about the MYC. Yeah. If you guys don't know what MYC is, it's like one of the original, yeah. not the original, but you know, 10, yep. 10, 12 years ago when weight loss was getting into clinics and stuff, that was like the main thing everybody talked about, MYC, MYC, MYC. Yep. So you guys are getting that in the Titan Up, which is very, very rarely talked about. Absolutely. So if you guys want to get a good, good fat burner, Titan Up's the way to go. Then what the ECA gives you the energy. Yep. So Titan Up every day, one a day, doesn't matter what time of day it is. Yep. And the ECA, before you work out or before you have to do something, they're pretty much, you know, you yeah. want to be awake. If you have to deal with oh, the yeah. kids all day long, first thing in the morning, boom. Oh, yeah. If you have to go to work, boom. If you have to go to the gym, boom, you're ready to go. And there's no jitters and no itchy, niacin yes. feeling, none of that yes. stuff. So you feel good off this. Yes, no heart palpitations and yeah. stuff like that. I know a lot of people, uh, they get scared because they've taken over-the-counter fat burners before yeah. from GNC or one of right. those big box stores. Um, and they have all this garbage in there and they make you feel nauseous and jittery and yeah. you, you, you're, you're bouncing out of your body. Um, a lot of, a lot of t sorry to cut you no, off, but no. a lot of times at the gas stations too, they sell those black oh, energy God. drinks. Those black Watch energy out. drinks, you guys know what the, what they are, you guys know what they're called. Those are 300 milligrams of caffeine. Yep. ECA is only 200. So if yep. you guys are pounding those all day long and you're worried about having a, a ECA, ECA yep. is actually less caffeine. So it's in a, in a lot, lot cleaner, a lot safer for you to take too. So. Sean, big shout out to you for having your appointment set. That's awesome. Donut Killer, what's going on? Vinny, what's up, dude? DT Roth, my man, what's going on? Uh, all right, big so, Irishman. Big Irishman and Hulk Squad. Hulk Squad at the our same dudes, time. Dudes, man, yeah. our dudes. So, yeah. All right, so with Tighten Up, it's awesome. And a lot of people ask me, hey, listen, what would be the optimal time to take Tighten Up? And you can take it any time through the day. Best time to take it probably is in the morning, 15 minutes before you've eaten. Now, it has mic in it, like he was talking about, methionine, inositol, and choline. And what these amino acids do is they help you process fats through the liver faster. So it's helping your body get through these fats faster, so it's actually producing more energy for you too as well. So weight loss, energy from the B-complex, nervous system, B12 as well, and the one branch chain amino acid, leucine, um, to help enable weight loss as well. L currency for blood flow and weight loss. So you're getting a lot in that tighten up. ECA Stack Plus, we have our low version or high version for you guys because people are different in their sensitivity to stimulants. Now with the ECA, you're getting more carnitine. Uh, so you get B12 and you get chromium. Chromium, okay. okay. Chromium. chromium. So there, there's really the only overlapping ingredient in ECA and a tighten up would be B12. B12. Um, awesome. But that's not a problem. You know, you excrete B12, it's water soluble, so you can't overdose on B12. Yeah, with B12, too, I mean, I know for me, I need a lot of it. Yeah. I just feel like I need sure. a lot of it. It's not like something, it's not a stimulant where you have to worry about taking too much. I mean, yep. obviously, don't take. An extreme amount, yeah. but even if even for the people that I know that used to take the tablets, they would take a bunch of them. Now you just have to take one shot. It's a lot easier. At one shot, you're done. You're, you're <laughs> it's done. It's so much easier than yeah. all those tablets all day long. Yes. Yeah. Um, so Donor Killer asked, uh, if you have a weird reaction to Summerolin, what could you take to supplement that? So if you're having a weird reaction to Summerolin, now there's a small percentage of the population, and I'm one of them, um, that when you take this injection, like 15 minutes afterwards, um, you feel really lethargic. You feel like mm -hmm. somebody's ripped the soul out of you, um, profuse sweating, that's what I went through, like I ran a marathon, mm -hmm. uh, and just, you know, I couldn't get up. So you have to lay down for like 15 minutes. And like, it gets, you get over it, but it almost it m makes me think like hypoglycemic. So yeah. like sugar levels just drop real low. You squirt some honey in your mouth and you think yeah, something's Yeah, you know, so at that point, what yeah. I used to do, I, I used to get sugar and orange yeah. juice, and I used to eat something sugary and drink it. But at that point, for me, like, that's not what I really want to be doing if I take this medication, right? So at that point, what I've been using is, is IGF-1. Um, now, you could use MK677, which is an oral. But usually, people don't really have that reaction with CJC-1295 and Imperolin. Um, but, you know, everybody's different. So you could get that reaction. I'm not saying you couldn't, but a lot of people don't. But if you're looking for something different, maybe IGF-1 or R3, that might be a good good way for you to go. Or MK677, Ibutamortin, that's another way to go. We both offer those therapies as well. Doesn't Titan Complete have B12? Yes, so Titan Complete has B12. So what Titan Complete is, is Titan Complete was my upgraded version to Titan Up. 
because Titan Up only had one branch chain amino acid. I said, listen, if we're going to do this, let's make it better. Let's make it overall all around. Let's put all three and the only three branch chain amino acids in there, mm -hmm. leucine, isoleucine, and valine. And at that point, you guys could get everything you guys needed. So when you took the injection in the morning, you're getting B-complex, you're getting the MYC, you're getting the B12, but you're getting all three branch chain amino acids. Mm -hmm. Instead of carrying around a cup with you all day and drinking this, this I pop. hate that. This is the I used worst, to have that dude. The thing with the BCAs too is if if you mix them with like cold water because you want it to be cold because it already has that yeah. foot taste. Yeah. You know, BCAs have that foot taste, like that foot <laughs> smell. It's like, but when you mix True. it with cold water, it foams up. So then you have to use hot water. So then you're drinking like hot. Tastes like a hot fruit punch foot. Yeah. I hate yeah. this. <laughs> so <laughs> this is just a lot better, you know? I mean, you don't want to fill, you He's know. brought you, me back. I, I right? It. Dude, Before I Titan, I used to be mixing that stuff all day. BCA burping breath and heartburn. Oh, I hated it. Before Titan, that's exactly what I was doing. Yeah. <laughs> all right? So, you know, we go to like GNC or these big box or something stores, wherever that it was. Jugs all day long. Dude, I used to buy like three or 400 bucks worth with the stuff just there on the counter, right? Mm. With your proteins, and your, your BCAs, oh. you had this, you had that. So at that point, like when I when we introduced Titan Medical Center, and I was looking, I was like, "Listen, man, I was like, there's got to be a better way. Yeah, there's got to be something that's more efficient, more effective, right? And we can get a better transportation. And that's when I looked in the injectables. And all the way back, you guys go to social media. All the way back to 2012 is when I introduced some of these different injectables, mm -hmm. first ones on the market. So at that point, when I did these blends, I was like, "Man, I was like, yeah, I can get everything in one injection." I mean, within a minute or two minutes, and I'm good to go on my yeah. day. I ain't got to carry nothing with me. I don't have to go to the bathroom before I work out because of the stuff that I drank beforehand. Yeah, yes. I mean, dude, it's nasty. You know, it's just it's just nasty stuff. It doesn't it's make nothing you feel worse than being all amped up at the gym and having to use the bathroom on a leg day or something yeah. crazy. Nice yeah. jumpsuit again. So, oh, I like it. One of two, Thank baby. You. That blue's looking I'm good. I'm gonna bring it out more often. Absolutely. Yeah. No, we're gonna definitely order some more of these for sure because. Yeah. You know, all of our jumpsuits were black and stuff like that, you know, because yeah, it's just a really good pops. color, right? Yeah. It doesn't get dirty as easy. Yeah, you know, I, love, I always work out it. in the black ones because I'm always metal, chopped and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So, you this know, is nice, though. Definitely nice. So it looks really good. It looks really, really good. So, yeah, so that's the difference of those things. So thank you guys to all you guys that came to the Titan booth at Olympia. Definitely. It was, it was a good success. time. It was a good time. It was a smaller event than normal. You know, obviously it was, right? it was a lot smaller, but... The turnout that was there for the yeah. size that it was was good. The energy was good. Even oh, the other ven vendors, the energy was good. Yep. You know, blessings came over, talked to us yep. for a little bit. It was good. Yep. You know, it was good. The reindeer was there. We got to dance with was the awesome. reindeer and stuff like that. That was so awesome. It was a good time. Everyone came through. It was a real, real good time. Really, really, really good, good time. time. So hopefully they have it in Orlando next year. Yeah. We'll see. Hopefully if they lock it in and everything's full open, not just here but everywhere else. Yep. Then it'll be like a real Olympia experience. Yeah, buddy. I feel bad for the people that have never been to the Olympia. This is their first time. Yeah. And they got to, I mean, they, they may have had a great time, but they're not really going to get that. Yeah, they like, didn't get that pop. Yeah, yeah. Especially like an expo type thing. Yeah, oh, man. Yeah. When you used to walk in the expo, it, it, it you know, Hundreds of booths. Dude, hundreds. I mean, it's just, it's like, whoa. And it yeah. just keeps going and yeah. going and going. So it's really a sight to see. Um, so, you know, everything with COVID, everything that I've been to this year, like event-wise, you know, has been kind of ugh, like because yeah, you, you, you don't know, you just don't know, you don't know. But be actually, good, New man. Year's, New Year's was uh, oh yeah, pretty decent. New oh, Year's, yeah. New Year's was it wasn't slow at oh, no. all. It was a line. <laughs> it was a line. It was packed. It was, it was, it was wall good. to wall. It was. It, it was, was good. It was good. It was good. It was definitely a good time. Uh, so I'm glad. I'm thank yeah. goodness. Yeah. So another question with Hercules Potion Titan Complete, you wouldn't need BCAs drink with it, so I can just drink water after taking the therapy. Yeah. Yep. That's, exactly. that, that's the plus, man. Yeah, that's, the that, that's, that's why you're doing these injectables. The whole point of doing these injectables is so you don't have to drink that stuff. Right. You can save money on not drinking it too as well, and you're getting something that's way more efficient and way more effective right. for you guys. And I think you guys will see a difference in this too because when you're drinking these different things, you guys are getting different ingredients and different things that are in there. Fillers. Right? And yeah. So this could be affecting some of your different results too or, or maybe holding water in different ways or, or just maybe something that is not helping you in optimal result wise so I, yeah. another thing too with bca is sometimes they make your stomach feel a little funny oh yeah like you can't explain it it just makes your stomach feel off yeah and then it's harder to eat so that'll yep. affect your gains as well if you're not eating the right time amount of food we take, take hercules it's not even going 
now, near your stomach. You're, so bi- you're bypassing the, the gastro tract on every injectable. Yeah, so it's not going to affect you. It's not going to affect you know, your eating and all that you know, stuff. You're, bif- you're bypassing the liver, like passing yeah. through there. I mean, that's the best thing about the injectables. Uh, we're not putting stress on the, on these different vital organs. You're not having to you know lose um, some of the concentration because it's getting broken down. That's the best thing about it. So, you know, intermuscular injections with a little insulin needle is very simple, very easy. Right. Any Anybody that I've ever talked to, and 7 out of 10 patients, if you can believe that, mm. I've never done any kind of injectables before, whether it's a vitamin injectable or a testosterone shot, and they're kind of scared, which is... I would be paranoid to try to put a contact lens into my eye. Right? Like, I have bad eyes, I need glasses, and people are like, yeah, it's contacts. I, I, I don't think I could put a contact in my eye, but I can take an injection in my sleep. <laughs> So I'm not, I'm not worried. You know, so different people have different things. But yeah, I'm afraid I like it's going to slide back or something. Just the injection, just boom, that's it. Let's that's go. it. it yeah. You know, and the people that do go through it and they do it the first time, like, oh, wow, that, that, that was virtually painless. And, and now yeah. you're going to get all these benefits. And now they're through it. And it's a survivor. It's just kind of getting over it. It's, it's a mind thing. Yeah, it's not steroids. It's not a yeah. sight enhancement. Yes. It's not an oil. Yes. It's not an SEO. It's not yes. that stuff. It's literally aminos, the same kind you would take in the powder, yep. but pure farm grade, just going directly to the muscle. So, Scal and Mike, are you looking for our vitamin amino acid injectable therapies? They should be on there underneath the vitamin amino acid injectables. What up, Real Life Zara? What's going on, Troy? Hulk Squad. Build the foundation of the castle will only be as big as the basement. That's true. <laughs> Leg day, chest, tries, calves. So these guys are hitting it hard. These yeah, guys Hulk are Hulk Squad and hard. Irishmen. Those yeah. guys go hard. You guys are ever in Tampa, you got to hit me up. We'll for go sure. crazy in the gym. For we'll sure. Go crazy. We got a video of that bad boy, too. Yeah, we'll go crazy. What up, Dwayne? How you doing? All right, so the next topic is... Elon Musk is selling all his possessions to go lie, to go live on Mars. Yeah, I can't believe this guy. He he passed Bezos being the richest guy in the world, 184 billion. What richest that, man in the world. What that means is right now, if he just sat down and didn't spend any money in his bank, he would be getting 73 million dollars a week for 50 years. That's, That's right. ridiculous. And this guy could literally give everybody a million dollars in the country and still and, have money. and still be balling. Still balling. And still be on the top five. Oh, you know, for sure. More. For sure. Yeah. So. You know, think about that. But he's selling all. He sold all his houses in California. He's selling all his possessions because he, he's making it serious that he wants to go live on Mars and other people he wants to bring with him. He wants to colonize it. He wants to bring air, dirt, the whole nine. We're talking about Total Recall. If you guys remember that, if you guys are old as us, this with Arnold Schwarzenegger, this is yeah, the dome, the whole nine, yeah, right? I remember the movie. Like I the remember girl, the post- three boobs. No, I never saw the movie. Oh. I remember seeing like highlights. I remember like being a We're kid, seeing it. like posters and stuff. Great yeah, movie. Yeah. Total Recall. All, if you haven't Arnold seen it. Movies. You need to have like an Arnold Marathon. We're going to have an Arnold Predator. Marathon. Commando. Man, I mean, Commando, dude. That was the... That was the sh- Conan the Barbarian. Conan. I mean, dude. The Predator. Conans. Predator. Predator was the... I mean, come on, yeah. man. We're, we're, Arnold's... Man. Oh, I can just keep going and keep Even going. Even twins. I love twins. <laughs> twins was hilarious. <laughs> I mean, dude. I would I mean, sleep on the floor. <laughs> I remember that part like his sister. You know, so yeah. even kindergarten cop, you know, yeah. we'll mention that one. Yeah. The only one that, you know, is Junior. So when he was pregnant and the whole yeah. night. Yeah. You know, I don't think I've seen that one. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's probably yeah, yeah. You, don't, you don't need to see that one. You don't need to yeah. see that one. Every other one, though, is definitely a, a, a blockbuster banger for sure. Arnold Schwarzenegger, big shout out. But, um, yeah. So So Elon was selling it to get more fun, to get more money, to get up there with Yeah. Yeah. He's trying started. to get 200 billion. Yeah. <laughs> He's funny. He's funny all this money, man. It's just crazy. And, you, you, this guy has always been ahead of the curve with electronic vehicles, yeah. with, with Space RX. I mean, people were telling this guy, you cannot do this. You won't be able to do this. And he's usually, he's he's right now using NASA to ship these rockets up. So he shipped his rockets up through NASA. Think about that. What I want the to know, best in the country. What I want to know if anybody out there does know or if you know is how long does it take to go to Mars? So say if... If I want to go to Mars right now, if I have the money, if I'm, so for whatever can. reason, like once I'm on the aircraft, yep. rocket, whatever you want to call it, how long does it take once it takes off before I actually land there? So they, they sent up a Tesla with an astronaut man in it. Oh, so yeah. it went to Mars. Um, seven seven months. months. That's not that long. Seven months. It's not that long. That is long. <laughs> That's not that long. But you're going to be going like a million miles an hour, so it's like. You, you won't really even feel it. It'll be like a cruise ship going to space. Man, we could go miles. lift weights every day for seven months, get there all jacked in Mars. Yeah, but that's the thing. What is the? That, yeah, that depends too. What What's it going to be like on the plane? Not the plane, the, the rocket. Rocket. Yeah. Oh, they have everything. 
They have oh, they, I don't know. They should, they should they might be, be like the size yeah. of a cruise ship. It should be like the size of a cruise ship. It should be. And they might even have the gravity air put into it. So They're going to have to do it. something. Either put people this to sleep. Getting, this is literally that, you'll like have atrophy movie. at that point. You this wake up. I mean, we don't. We, it's not like movies where they you seven know, months. We'll have about three and a half months. You change your mind. Up. Oh, oh well. It's like being quarantined. You're on. Yeah. Oh. Oh yeah. A year and a half just to travel. Over nineteen thousand people applied compared to ten years ago. Oh wow. To go. That's crazy. Yeah. That's nuts. How old are these wow. people? I mean, they could be young people. I don't think. No, but I mean, if I was eighty nine, I would be like, well, let's just go, whatever. I don't think they pass the test to even go up there. Yeah. You got to be some sort of health. That's a big thing. You can't just be. I can, yeah. You can't be sick to go up and do this. I mean, I, you know, so you're gonna have to be healthy. Um, the next one, Tampa game. Super Bowls in one month. Many unknowns. What yeah, up, Stacy? Yeah, there's a lot of unknowns. I know when I was reading. I don't know because you said the tickets, they do have tickets. They got tickets. Some of the places don't have tickets yet. I know a lot of the tents and stuff that's going on. Yep. That's new. Riverwalk, is they supposed to have some big thing going on at Riverwalk? Yep. None of that's listed. All the apps and websites that you go to for these events, nothing's yep. on there yet. Yep. So it's like, who knows what's going to happen. It's crazy. It doesn't even feel like the Super Bowl is going to be a temple. I know. Like, We're getting when it was the last time, it was like huge I everywhere. Know. I mean, I yeah, there's Go Buck stuff around town, yep. but it doesn't have that feel where... You know, I used to, it used to be crazy when the Super Bowl. Dude, I mean, yeah. listen, if this was pre-COVID, everything would be up and crazy as hell right now. Yeah. And our economy would be booming here, especially in Tampa. We missed out on the on the World Series. Think about it. Our Tampa Bay Rays went to the World Series this year. We didn't even get to get a game here in Tampa. Yeah. That, that hurt pretty bad. Mm. You know, with the Super Bowl, this is supposed to just generate millions and millions of dollars for the local economy. It's not doing that. It's not going to do that because of what's going on with COVID. And then the ticket prices. The ticket prices are the root because they got limited capacity. Yeah. That's why the ticket prices. So, you know, it's like, if you guys like, notice, everything is more expensive now. Yeah, because it's less people that can do it. Instead of having 50,000 tickets, now they're going to do 10. They're going to raise them 10 times. It's crazy. So it's like, you know. The NFL experience outside festivals. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Now, that's supposed to be for free. Yeah. Right, yeah, which is really free. cool, and that's never for free. Usually, you need to get tickets because mm -hmm. the last Super Bowl was supposed to go to. I want to see what they're going to do at Riverwalk <laughs> over around the corner. They're supposed to be doing something at Riverwalk. It's going to be awesome. Yeah. I mean, I, you know, it's going to help a little bit, but it's not going to be. It's going to be like Olympia. And like, yeah, okay, yeah. you know, it's pretty cool, but yeah, man, this this same. thing was so much yeah. better, you know. Yeah. So uh, uh, the thing that sucks now is that building Tampa up so I know. much. This build, it's like Dubai. This building's going I up. Know. Every other week, all not for this, but they're trying to get it done before the Super Bowl. Oh yeah, everything's gonna be built up. This is gonna be what now? All this money spent, and then no one wants to do anything. That's all right. Hopefully, it's good. That's all know. right. You know, our, you know, that's one thing. We are lucky to live here in Florida. Yeah, our economy is here in Florida locally. It's not doing as bad. And I, I just had a friend who's from Tampa and who lived in LA for like I don't know six seven years straight, and he just moved back to Tampa mm. two days ago. And he told me it was so bad, John. He's like, listen, it's so bad because most of the businesses can't do any business, mm -hmm. right? Uh, he's like, the last time I ate in a restaurant was in March, inside. Outside's now closed down, so you can't eat outside. Where is it? California, wow. L.A. And he said, Gold's Gym Venice. He's like, dude, because the population of the homeless have went up three times. Mm -hmm. He's like, it looks like Skid Row. Yeah, right outside, it dude. It looks bad. bad. It. He's like, it That's stinks of urine and, and and feces and like all this like druggies going on out there. So it's like, it's not good. It's not good. It's not good. He's, he's we like, got, we're spoiled over here in Florida. We are. Real we are. Real God bless us here. God bless us. Okay, well, we yeah. shipped on events, so we're just gonna stay open to make yeah. it. Yeah, right. Yeah, that's that's what it is. So you know, even with us, you know, type we do a lot more events usually. And this year, it's just it's it's definitely knocked us down with some of the events, but that's okay. We keep rolling, we keep rocking and rolling, man. Yeah. Um, all right. So Jordan wins trademark battle with China for forty six thousand dollars. Now this uh, lawsuit in China has been going on. I don't know how long. I maybe I've read about this. I think it's I think it's definitely been over at least eight or nine years. And what happens is, is China, <laughs> this is funny, China, they like to steal all this intellectual property and they've done this to many businesses across the board. Well, they basically, they use this jump man mm. and they put him on his own shoes and they call it a different shoe. Wait, they, what? Yeah. Well, the name they have literally means says yeah, Jordan. It says they Jordan. Name in Chinese. But the, the jump man is the exact same. So what, do you have a picture of the shoe? What do you mean? It's, it's yeah, a, yeah, so on the shoes they sell in China, <laughs> it, it's a Chinese name, but it means Jordan. And then the jump man's on it. So it looks like Jordan's. So I wouldn't even know. 
and that's what I'm saying. So he's had this lawsuit going for copyright, and he owns an international copyright mm -hmm. on this. So it's not like he owns just a United States one. So he's been going back and forth in, in China. Mm -hmm. You know, they're they're a communist country, man. They they rule. So they have a piece of almost every every excuse me every business in China where they control it. If they don't like what something's going on, they just change it and help them just take over. How long was this going on though? This has been going on for like eight, eight or nine years at least. And it's only forty six grand. Yeah, he won forty six thousand that. bucks. Nothing. That's well, like nothing. That's... And think about the lawyer bills that he's had to pay. Yeah, way more 46 than forty six thousand. Like not even a. F that's like for him. That's like a flight there a week and then come back home. It's, it's nothing. <laughs> I mean, like like I said, so to, it costs forty six to his grand lawyer bills because he's probably got the best lawyers. Yeah. Those lawyers are probably charging eight fifty to a thousand dollars an hour. Think yeah. how many hours they've worked on this and what they charge him just for the paperwork. Yeah. I know because my lawyers cost me. Four hundred, six hundred, eight hundred dollars an hour. Yeah. So I know what I'm paying, and I don't like to pay lawyers. I need them, but I don't like to pay them. You know, for copyright and all that, for trademarks. Oh wow! It's nuts, man. Wow! It's nuts. Gordon Jordan. <laughs> wow! See, I wonder if it's uh, it, like. Is this like stuff they have at flea markets and stuff? No, over there? no, no. This or is, is like, like mainland China. Store? Okay. Yeah, this is in actual stores. Okay. So like sneakerheads aren't buying these shoes, though, are they? Well, I mean, or in China, China they are. Yeah. I've never heard. That's weird. I've never heard oh, of this. Wow, like, it's the actual image of him. It's the image, dude. Yeah, I mean, look at the Raptor. Crazy. Look at the shoe. Yeah. I mean, it's the exact same shoe. Yeah. It's just that little logo change, and that's a done deal. But wow. that's what it means. So, you know, they got their own Chinese Jordans over there, which are really, really Looks crazy. Like a shack. <laughs> right? The shack with the yeah. logo. Oh, yeah, they ripped down. The shacks. Oh, that was awesome. All right. I tried a lot getting them popped in different nitric oxide boosters, drinking a lot of tablespoon sorrow. Work out, try a lot of salt. Hercules Potion, baby. That's definitely the one, man. Yeah, yeah. I'm heading my fifth week with Hercules Potion, and holy shit, my veins are coming out crazy. <laughs> Thanks, boss. You're welcome, man. I'm glad you're getting it. That's good. What up, Jimmy? How you doing, man? Good to see you, man. Oh, oh, my life just went down. Hey, Irishman, come on to mine. John's yeah. live is up. Yeah. Oh, man. That sucks. Oh, well. I'm sorry, John. Guys. John's thing disconnected. Sorry. Me. I disconnected my thing. So. Irishman, jump on mine or jump on Titan Facebook. Last thing. CDC offers incredible immunity news. So this was really, really cool. So immunity-wise, they've been wondering, listen, if you catch COVID, how long are you going to have antibodies or immunity to COVID? So we've been wondering this ourselves, me and Sharice, since we caught COVID and been blood tested. Sharice did a blood test yesterday. She still has the antibodies. I don't have the antibodies. My buddy from LA just came in the other day. He still has the antibodies eight months later. So everyone's different. Everybody's different. Everybody's so different. what these studies said was, it's really crazy. If you're asymptomatic or you're mild, you're supposed to have up to eight months immunity. And at that point after that, it could be T cell immunity. So that's one thing. So antibodies are one thing. And then you have T cells, which are in thymosin alpha-1, which helps augment and bring up T cells. So at that point, a lot of people are going to be, if you catch it, eight yeah. months, nine months, good as far as immunity-wise. So, you know, hmm. these people might not want the vaccine right away or something like that. That's been a whole other flip-flop thing is the vaccine. Do you want it? Do you not want yeah, it? Yeah, I'm going to wait like, a little longer, see how people react to it. Me too. Me too. I, I'm going to honestly goes go See if they have any new ones, new advances <laughs> in the vaccine, all yeah. that stuff. It's kind of like, you know, you got to wait a little bit. Well, you got Moderna out there I be the and trial Pfizer. Yeah. So these two vaccines need two doses, right? Um, where the Johnson & Johnson one that's coming out here very shortly and should get approval is only going to be one dose. Mm. So, you know, I'd rather have one dose than getting two doses of so it, right? Approved, so, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, so at that point, that's we'll good. see how it goes. And uh, we'll see how these things go. I mean, it's been a circus to even get a vaccine. Even here in Florida, my mom and my grandma and all these people are trying to mm. get the vaccine. My grandma's 89 years old, high risk. Mom's 68 years old, high risk. Uh, and they, they haven't got it yet, but other people have been getting these vaccines. It's just been crazy. So yeah. we'll see, man. I, I definitely don't want to be the first one to get it either, for sure. No. But uh, when we get it, when they even offer it to us, it's going to be like six months guaranteed, seven months. They haven't even rolled it out the way they thought they were going to roll it out. So think yeah. how far behind we really are. I mean, this is it's just, it, you know, they're saying that Fauci said that we're not going to be normal mm -hmm. until next October. And that's what they said last yeah. Is it last? Yeah. No, 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 guys. Remember, 15 minutes to slow this, or 15 days to slow the spread. Yeah. <laughs> How long has it been? 15 months. <laughs> 15 <laughs> months. What is going on? It's going up. What is Nothing's going on? Strange. It's crazy. Yeah. All right. So, events. Guys, I'm sorry. There's only two events that we can even list right now because of COVID. <laughs> and that's 221 Festival of Speed St. Pete. That got moved. 
from 110. So hopefully that goes on. Um, and that's in St. Petersburg and Von Park. That's going to be a good one. I love the car shows. I love Hopefully them. it goes. Yeah. Uh, so we'll, we'll see. Hopefully, cross our fingers, we're going to have it. Um, if not, don't worry. That weekend's my birthday weekend. We're doing oh, something. Yeah. 314, and I'm 40 years old. 314, Festival oh. of Speed Orlando. So we'll be out at Ritz-Carlton, hopefully, on their beautiful property, representing, seeing all these beautiful cars, having a great time outside. Hopefully, in March, usually the weather starts getting a lot better, too. So, yeah. I mean, not to say it's not good now, but hopefully it'll be a lot better than what it is. It's a lot better than a lot of other places. Oh, for sure. Yeah. For sure. It's, I'm still outside walking around hot I mean, you can, sunshine. Yeah, so. I'm hot in this. So you guys yeah. can see. It's, it's really nice in Florida. We're Spoiled. lucky. Spoiled. Absolutely. Spoiled. Mark Puchetti, Flex Steel, is watching you guys. Really? Awesome. Big Flex shout out. Flex Steel. The Flex Wheeler Flex Steel? Hmm. Huh. You guys hosting Super Bowl party? So, we don't know. We've got asked to be sponsors to multiple Super Bowl parties. Now, the thing is this. Is that here, and you know, we're open here, but they're starting to crack down on some of these different things. They have put some restrictions in place on bars and gatherings. So they want you, if you're at a bar, to be sitting down. Nobody's to be gathering on the dance floors. So this last couple of weeks, the clubs here in Tampa just haven't cared, right? Mm. And they're like, you There's know, a lot, a lot of, lot we'll of get a fine. Yeah, a and the fine was only 150 bucks. So the, the bars, the owners are like, who cares? I'll pay the 150 bucks and make it a hell of a lot more than revenue. Yeah. But what happened is, is now they've been fined. And some of these places, like, like some local places that are really cool spots, been fined twice. Mm. Now the city council said that they could restrict or take away their liquor license, which That's is huge. like a death sentence. That's like 30, 20 grand. It's like a that. death sentence. <laughs> it's up to So they're going to have to go in front of the city council because of this, and hopefully the city council doesn't take away their licenses. Maybe so that, that we'll might see. be what it takes for them to actually say, you know what, I'm not going to pay the fine. Because a lot of people have money to pay. I mean, that's like... Yeah, nothing. But, I mean, yeah, but I mean, making thousands of dollars every night off of a bar. Yeah, you, you really make two hundred dollars. Okay, fine. yeah, great. Okay, yeah. Well, stay open, like, well, I mean, it's going to make know, them like, adhere to CDC guidelines. Exa- yeah, it's going to force them to do. It's it, going to so. force them to yeah. wear, make people wear masks. Um, and at that point, they're going to have to do other things, you know, like you know, not have people dance on the dance floor, which kills their bar too, as well, right? Might as well yeah. call it a restaurant. Yeah. All right, what up? That's exactly what they're going to do. That's what they did last time. <laughs> one, of, one, of my, one of my friends, uh, they did it he, last he time. He used to be a promo- he still promotes one of the biggest promoters yeah. in Tampa, whatever. But he said the same thing. He had like a meme that said, uh, "The clubs can't be open." He's like, "Club? We're a restaurant, right?" Like, it's exactly right? what's going to happen. All you got to do is just say, "We're a restaurant." If you serve food, anyways, yeah. I'm a restaurant. Well, I know a gym on the West Coast. They uh, they actually they, they got it so that they were like a church. It's like oh, a church yeah. of health. Oh. And at that point, you go work out in there, and you're praising the religious. Like, God. <laughs> yeah, religious always a religious way. protection. Yeah. So that's pretty cool. Uh, what up, Super Bowl in Tampa, Lord, Florida, Georgia is huge for tailgating here in Jackson. Ulysses is asking about uh, blood work for CJC. You don't need blood nope. work for that. No, nope. just fill out the new patient paperwork. You can see you the go medical to, uh, provider the website, or go to my Instagram, click the link. Yep. You can just fill everything out and get started on it. Yep. So it's very easy, very simple to do, guys. Fill out the new patient paperwork. Go on Drew's link on there. It'll take you there, or go to the website for the new patient paperwork. Fill it out. We'll call you. We'll get you scheduled for your medical consultation, and at that point, you can purchase that therapy. And even more possibly, Hercules Potion Titan Complete yeah. ECA. So you can talk about all these great therapies and see which one might be best for you, or you might be able to use. And also, too, if you guys don't have a connection, I had someone the other day say they were trying to, they need to get started, but they didn't have an internet connection, 727-389-3220. Just call us and we can have everything set up over the phone. Um, I know some places the internet was down. Like the other day, I guess some places the internet was down. Yeah. So uh, you could always just call the number, guys, and get everything set up that way, too. That's tight. You got the number and the link on Facebook. So now you have the Facebook up there, so you just just click on that link and I'll take you right there to whatever we have to do. So, guys... It's been a great Titan lifestyle. We're happy to be back. Great to be back. It was too long. Too long. Too long. It's been like three weeks since we've done this. So yes. Yes. It's good to be back. Everything's back in order. Festivals of Speed's coming up next month. And then the month after that, we have another one. Yep. Hopefully more Titan events come on. We'll be here every week at 2 p.m. Check out John Titan Talk on Tuesdays at 6 p.m. And also the ABC Lifestyle Show Sundays. ABC? Yeah, ABC, 11 a.m. 11 a.m. 11 a.m. If you guys don't get uh, ABC, the Florida, if you're not here in Florida, check out our YouTube channel or it goes on Instagram too on Sundays for you guys. So I appreciate you guys tuning in. I'm John. I'm Big Drew. See you next week at 2 p.m. Have a great weekend. Later, guys.